Hello Minecrafters out there, my name is Fape and welcome back to episode 38 on the Survival Inc. server. And today we have to do something more or less special. I was just killed, maybe the death message is still here? Nah, I talk too much with code. <laughs> and uh, yeah, I was killed by a zombie and this is something that does not happen um, too often, especially with full diamond gear, but it was not only one zombie It was about 10 15 zombies a whole zombie siege uh, Came over this village once again and tr uh, all the villagers. Oh, man We still I think I could save some of them No one in here Come on guys, where are you? Please don't leave me alone. Oh, yeah, there they are all right, but Pretty much this whole house here was full of zombie villagers and I think they came from um, back from our new house we got back here because it wasn't w uh, lit up well enough around the garden area and around the place here I suppose. So yes, we have to do something ab about that. Um, first of all we have to secure at least two of the villagers. That's the least we can do and therefore we should build a little bit of an, an underground shelter or a, a bunker <laughs> where they can survive such a zombie ac apocalypse and are prepared for such things <laughs> and um, I figured um, this is a nice small little house it doesn't seem like much so it's ideal to hide a little bunker under it don't you think guys Maybe just dig a little bit down, not too deep because I have to get the villagers down there <laughs> and back up there if we really need them once. So maybe that should be enough actually and maybe just a small little bunker right, yeah, pretty much the same size of the house could work out. I don't have a shovel yet, but uh, let me hollow some, some stuff here out and maybe build a little bit already. And then we'll see if we can get some villagers down here to live here. <laughs> Let's have a look in here. I already trapped one of them down here, <laughs> more or less by accident. I dug up and he fell just down here. So we got already one, one of our shelter villager down here. And of course the walls um, have to be out of solid stone brick, so no zombies or missiles can penetrate it. <laughs> and I brought some ladders as well. Can villagers climb ladders? I don't th think so. Can you? Huh? No, you can't. Can you? I don't think so. Um, let's give them... Um, a crafting table down here of course they need a crafting table to survive and what else does a villager need to survive he does need a furnace and he does need some supplies he will need um, a few potatoes I guess just ah, it's really hard to get him kind of random in there. Well, random enough. Potatoes, I think, the best um, kind of food source because it won't get bad that fast, as for example, um, meat. What else do we need? We need kind of a shelf here. Oh, we can't open the chest, of course, we can't. Hmm, can we trick it somehow? Let me try. Uh, uh, we might be able to trick it. Let's use a stair in this way. This should work. And a chest with some coal supplies to... Yeah, the furnace is, um, is uh, to make a source of food and to keep them warm in here. Uh, I kind of want to have it a little bit more narrow from this uh, yeah the ceiling should be a little bit deeper so they get kind of the, the, the real bunker feeling in here 
Maybe I want to replace this. Do I want to replace this chest? Yep. Never mind that. <laughs> it's not good for the design. Let's place it. Let's place it. Where should we place it? Maybe up here. Oh, we have to use the stair trick again. Hopefully it works on this side as well. Yes, it should work. Because we want our villagers safe to be from any zombie apocalypse. Some coal. And do I have some wood on me? I do. Let's give them some shelves in here as well. Uh, not there. Maybe one yeah, up here. No, up here. That's better. <laughs> Yeah, it's not much of a of a bunker, but it's enough for the villagers to survive. And we need to worry about how to get another one in here. Let's make floor out of stone brick as well. <laughs> I wonder if they can live here well when when zombies really would take over the whole village. Maybe we'll find out someday. Get out of my way. Oh, oh, don't, don't. No, let me give you a nice floor, please. All right, thank you. Um, I need, I need a trap door for this. <laughs> there we go. Huh? Do you feel already a little bit cozy? Let's give him something to sit on maybe just maybe ah, something to sleep on no we won't have a bed down here we'll just have those little those little ah come on get out of this corner come on those little planks uh, where they can sleep on you won't get out of this corner oh there you go come on just a little bit further please i beg you you know what, let's take this shelf. I don't want to use another... Oh, it's raining again? It just rained. Please, can you get out of here? Ah, Alright, let's see if we can find... Ah, that's not the best way to put a trapdoor, is it? Let's put it on the other side so we can get out of here without any problems. Like so. And then we have to find another villager to get him down here. <laughs> So they can reproduce after the zombie apocalypse. How do we want to do that, Mr. Villager? I don't think this will work. Nope, it obviously won't. We need to get him in this shack here. Let's let's try to destroy the door and see what... Oh! Let's try to destroy the door to see what happens. Maybe you will all come out of there? Huh? It's night time? Wanna come out? Let's destroy this door as well. And then hopefully they will all stream out onto the place. Oh! I don't wanna punch you, mister. And then they hopefully will all stream out onto the place and... Come on! Are you serious? There goes the door. Come out, guys! Nothing in there that holds you there. Alright, you have only one choice here. I set this up and... I just hope it will work. Not sure. Hey, misters. Can I give you a little push? Come on. You want to have a nice home, don't you? They are searching for the house up there. I can feel it. Yeah, come on. Let's get you out of here. A nice pre... Oh, there's another one in there. Awesome. Let's close this off. And let's hope one of them... Oh, there are quite a few guys. How are they getting in here? Did I leave something open? No, I don't think so. Yes, that's the right direction, Mr. Awesome. No, 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 no. No, no. Please. Please, please, please. Please. Go on. This direction. Here. Come on. Look at me. I want to show you your new home. So... No, don't push him back. Yes, blacksmith. Nice. Come over. Let's 
close him off so he can't go back. There's just one way to go, guy. <laughs> Maybe the librarian wants to come. No, don't push him back. Oh, it was kind of stupid. <laughs> Just one way to go, guys. Don't have to look at me like that. Don't trust your green eyes. Yeah, it's a dead end. This direction. <laughs> oh, look at him. No, don't go back. Yes, that's the right direction. All right, I was just about to use, yeah. Let's use, no, yeah, no. Let's use uh, desperate measures here and try to wash him out. That should work, right? Take the water and let's try it again. Oh yes, oh yes, oh yes, yes! No! Stop! Stop right there, mister. And you too, in case I, le I lose the other one. Alright. That's exactly where you're supposed to go. Come in here. Yeah, and then over here. And on the strap door and zoom. Nope, down there. Come on, you wanted to. Just stop walking. Don't resist it. You want to be down there, don't you? I know you want to be down there. Come on. Uh, can I get... I can't really get rid of the leather without hurting him. Let's try. Let's get rid of this ladder. Yes. Calm down. I know you want it. Nice. Here you are. Two blacksmiths. Are the, <laughs> are the guys who have to carry the fate of all the villager kind. Hey guy, what are you doing up down there? Alright, now you have your beds. Let's place some ladders again up. Awesome! Now we got our villager kind secured and safe in a nice anti-zombie apocalypse bunker. <laughs> you can be free now, Mr. Priest. Sorry for the inconvenience I provided to you. <laughs> Alright, let me quickly clear up all this dirt here. Here we are again. Everything is cleaned up. Oh no, not quite. I have to place the doors again. And now we have secured our villagers in the bunker. We need to take one or two more measures to keep them all alive and to keep them reproducing also. So we have our villager breeding cell up there. I want to get rid of it of course because it's not really helping with the whole look of the place. And um, I want to try and set it up in the in the upper half of this house here, maybe back here. I'm not sure if this is gonna work with this kind of roof, um, but I want to try at least. Therefore, we have to get rid of some of the stuff, of course. And it's pretty basic. Just place some doors in here and get a villager up here, which will be a pain again. <laughs> Oh man, I should probably get some, some rails and the minecart going. It's probably easier than what I'm trying to do. Let's see, we have one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Five by five. Let's wall it off. And... Yeah, let's take... Let's make it like this for now. And now we have to get... How are we gonna do this? <laughs> can I break through here? Probably can. Alright. Can I make a staircase? That's my next question. Where the villagers will go up. Guy, huh? What do you think? Wanna go up there? Wanna try it? No? Maybe? Have I to get my minecarts out? Probably have to. Alright. Let me prepare something here and then get back to you. Alright, I place some doors here. I'm not exactly sure how this works and when they recognize them as their houses. 
but uh, we'll just have to try and hey mr priest wanna have a sit in my minecart it's quite cozy try it out come on no don't run oh blacksmith what about you heard you like iron huh i have a nice iron minecart for you what do you think sounds nice doesn't it one ever oh no don't run <laughs> Another priest. How do you feel in? Nice water stream. Yeah, that's the right direction. Can yes. No, 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 not not in there. Alright. Another blacksmith. What about you guy, huh? What do you think? Wanna test? Ride my minecart? Nice! I knew you were a clever guy. Don't jump up there, little guys. Come on, now everyone wants to get up there. Too late. I have already my my guy, so let's try and get him up here. Hopefully this will work. Yes, it seems nice. All right, so let's get him him in there. No, no, don't, don't. <laughs> Am I really so bad at such things? Oh man. Can you get over there again? And up. Nice, nice. And further up. All right, in there. In there, in there. All right, and now let's try if we can push him inside this area there without getting onto the... Can't you fit through there? Okay, let's try it the old-fashioned way. What is going on here? Where did he go? You are here, aren't you? Let me quickly relock. You are here. Just around the corner. Yes. And now let's close this off. Now you have your beautiful new home. And what we are now gonna, going to try is trap some villagers in here. There are already a villager in here. Can we get more in there? Or do we even need to get more in there? Or is it sufficient already? Let's wait. Let's, let's just leave it like that and clean up. And then we will just check if there is some breeding going on downstairs when the villagers come in for the night time. I have no idea if this is gonna work, but we'll see. Wow! Wow! Look at this, guys! I think he just spawned in here. Hey, mister! Are you going to protect my guys here? That would be awesome. And you too, can you please make some love, maybe? What do you think? Alright, you know what guys, we'll block him off in here and we'll check at the end of this episode if something happened between those two guys. It looks quite romantic already with their bodyguard there. Maybe they can figure something out and make some childs. Would be nice. My next question would be, in case you didn't notice, that's my first time I ever made something with villager breeding and villagers in general. But my next question would be, I heard that villagers, uh, villagers have to be 100 blocks apart from each other to be recognized as separate villages. Look at all those guys. And I was wondering if they have to be 100 in X and Z direction or just in diagonal direction as well. Because if that's the case, I want to build another breeding um, cell maybe up here in this area and this way get the whole island populated. That would actually be quite awesome. Not this house, but the next one maybe. Um, yeah, that would be really cool. And that would solve our problem to get this place a little bit more busy. I'm... yeah. Eventually I think Mojang has to do something about the village AI to make him a little more intelligent. Would be nice. Let's see, can we put the ceiling in here? I think we could and then make some other doors up there. I'll see what I can do. It's raining again. All right, we've repaired this little sky bridge over here. And now let's try to get this guy into this car. He already is <laughs> experienced in um, providing mass breeding. So he should be a good choice if he wants to go there. Come on. There's your minecart. This is your way. It seems like every one wants to go in this direction. Oh, wait, can you see this? How the villagers are wanting to go inside this house? 
Let's get him into this cart and then let's have a look at what's going on over there. Maybe I have to leave it, let him in. Maybe they already want to mass breed over there. Come on, get into your cart, mister. How can I get you in there? Come on, mister, you have to get your train. <laughs> Alright, let's try to get him this way. Huh? Nice minecart? What do you think? Nice, we got him. No! Don't die. Wow, that was a close one. Let's get rid of the dirt real quick. Oh man. He took quite some damage, I think, over there. <laughs> Hopefully not too much. He should survive the transport and he should live on up there in his new breathing cell. Let's get you onto the rail again. And then let's... Of course I... Should have saved one rail. I just have 32 I made. Okay, let's try if we can get him up to this place. Hopefully. Alright, here we go. Last last part of the rail. Come on. Oh, I can already hear a zombie. Hopefully he's just down there. I think so. Let's get rid of this one already and place some wool back in. Was it wool? I think it was. Anyways. Alright, let's get the doors. I think I left all the doors um, from the guy in a chest in his initial breeding cell. Right here. Alright. Uh, let's leave this. Get all the doors. Let's leave all the stuff. I don't need it right now. I will get it here in a minute. More doors, more doors. And even more, even more. I need you though. All right. Let's get him his doors and let's release him from his minecart. And then we should have another breeding cell, more or less. Depends on if it's working or not. Let's get rid of this block here. Is it light enough here? Let's place some torches down. Just to be safe. Nothing should be able to spawn in here. Uh, we can't place it there. But we can place it down there. I feel like there's a zombie right below us. That's not good. Alright. Let the door placing begin. Alright, that's all the doors I had at. So let's release him from his minecart. Oh, don't you dare bug him out. Don't want to punch you. Should be good. I think. I relocked the last time and he was there again. So let's fix up the roof. Let's take care of this screaming zombie. Oh, here you are. Where's the zombie? I think he's in the basement. I think it is hollow in there. Alright, now that we got our villager in here, we need two more villagers to get him into the bottom of the house. But first of all, let's grab our stuff and let's check out what's going on with our other, hopefully, breeding cell up there. Whoa! Seems like still just those two, but... <laughs> Apparently we got another bodyguard here, another iron golem. Maybe this house is going to be our iron golem farm. <laughs> I didn't expect that to happen. But it doesn't seem like they want a mate yet. Maybe later. We'll, wa we'll wait a little bit longer. Oh guys, can you hear that? Where? Oh no, not again! Zombie apocalypse is arriving! No! Oh no, don't you get in there. Oh, dang. No, you won't get him. You won't get him. You won't get this guy. Not until you have to walk over my dead corpse. Wow, there are more, there are more. Oh my god. What are you thinking? Oh, a, a baby villager? So that means at least we had a baby here. <laughs> at least something. But where? Where did they reproduce? This door seems to be glitched out. You are safe. I saved you. 
You should be safe in there. Did I come from down here again? No, this door is still intact. So where did they spawn? I hopefully, hopefully I didn't miss any. Oh man, these zombie uh, apocalypse scenarios are driving me nuts. <laughs> no one in here now. Well, anything else I have to repair? I don't think so. I was just about to get done with the, my uh, cleaning up the dirt. Well, I guess I will continue it and hopefully won't get interrupted by another zombie siege. Hmm, this one wants to mate. Why do you wanna... You wanna get in there? Come on. Don't wa I don't want to stand in the way between you two lovebirds. No? Not anymore? Well, in this case, I would really like to get you. Yeah, now you find to each other. No, don't run. He just wants to make a baby with you. <laughs> you little sweethearts. All right, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to get both of you guys, hopefully. You can... I won't... Just go on. I give you some privacy. <laughs> because you are the two guys who want to mate quite a bit up there in this house, hopefully, soon. But for now, go on. Oh, look at this guy. They made a baby. Congratulations. It's a boy. We'll name him... Dieter. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let me build some more rails here and then let's get those two lovebirds up there in the, their new home. Now that they are married, they can live together, don't they? <laughs> All right, we are finally on the last meters to your no new home, buddy. And you two lovebirds are... Oh. Don't you want him? Can't push him back. Let him in there, come on. <laughs> okay, let me try. Uh, no, not in here. Go in there. Come on. <laughs> Seems like he doesn't want to have him back. I, s I thought he was glad to have him back. Okay, let's try this. Alright. You are back together. You can celebrate now. <laughs> Feel free to celebrate. Don't you want to celebrate? Uh, how do I get in there without releasing them oh man after this day I have definitely enough with uh, <laughs> of working with villagers for quite some time it's so painful to get him where you want him to go oh wow all right guys let me clean this up and then we'll check once more back there if something happened and I think then we'll just call it an episode and Observe the whole situation during the next days and see if the breeding systems actually work. Oh, and if you, if one of you guys have an idea or actually know how they exactly work, let me know and maybe give me some tips how to improve the system and yeah, make it more efficient. But I just hope that it works and we get some nice villagers in in this town sooner or later. Hey, little guy, are you guarding the bunker here? Seems you two are still all right down there. All right, so I don't have to check on you. And now let's quickly check on our iron golem farm. <laughs> oh man, are you spawning more villagers in there? I I doubt it. I don't think it works. Uh, nope, that was not the jump I made. There comes John. Quickly. Greet him. Hey, John. And oh, yes! A small guy! Awesome! Maybe it works. Maybe we'll have a villager explosion in here soon. Oh man, that's so awesome. That's a nice, nice ending. Happy ending <laughs> for our episode. <laughs> Alright, let me head up the hill and enjoy the view on our town. Now, the first time since some time without the. The ugly villager breeding cell above our place. 
Let's see if I can get up there. I don't have any ender pearls left because I used them all while working with the villagers. Oh man, it's so frustrating. I'm so glad that it's over. But let's end this episode here. I hope you enjoyed. If you liked it, please feel free to leave a like. And I hope to see you all next time. So have a nice day. And seriously guys, don't be daft. Look in my eyes. Play some Minecraft.